Yes, people, today we are off to Dagenham and Redbridge versus Wrexham at the Chigwell Construction Stadium for the final uh, English um, vlog of the season. Um, and it's an important game today because Wrexham are second and they need a win to go up and obviously they need Stockport to slip up and Dagenham need to win and for Chesterfield to lose to get into that all-important playoff spot. So join me as we go to the Chigwell Construction Stadium today and we look forward to an excellent game. So yeah, join me. Today with Travis, Dagenham versus Wrexham FC. So, what's your score prediction for today's game? It's going to be a tough game, but obviously, two good teams. I'm going to say 1-1. One, one. Uh, one all draw, draw, yeah? Two tight, 1-1. One, one. One, okay, one. brilliant. Uh, I'm probably going to go for a 3-1 or a 4-1 no, four Wrexham win. 3-1, let's just hope for a good game. Lots of yeah. goals, you know Brilliant. Right? Cheers, See mate. Thank you. Food then, mate. Looks nice, man. Ten out of ten. Look at that hot chocolate, mate. What do we rate that? Disgrace. <laughs> Zero. <laughs> Tastes like water. <laughs>
finished Dagenham 3, Wrexham 0. We obviously got the prediction extremely wrong. We're now back in South East London enjoying a nice drink and a post-match um, interview we're going to give you. Um, so, what did you think of the game? I thought the game was good, man. I thought the first half was slightly slow. There wasn't a lot of quality, a lot of missed chances, but I thought the second half was really good, man. Three goals, um, Kamikaze with a goal. <laughs> High quality second half, good second half. Good game overall. And um, what did you think of the Wrexham fans? Wrexham fans are excellent, better than the home support. Loud all throughout the game, 3 0 down, uh, 90 minutes, full time whistle there, loud as anything, quality. quality. And did you think the score reflected the game? Not really, to be honest. I thought Wrexham deserved something, they just couldn't finish their chances. I think Dagenham looked bad in the first half, but then 3 0, so you know, fair play to them. But no, I wouldn't say so. I think. I think the draw would have been fair, to be honest. And what did you think of the ground, like facilities and like obviously food available, stuff like that? The ground itself was good. Reminds me of a ground back in, in my area, Welly. Uh, yeah. Facilities was all right. Food, burger was quality. The only thing about it was the hot chocolate. It tasted like water. It was horrible. And do you think Wrexham now, going into the playoffs, do you think they could get promoted or do you think they're going to bottle it? I think this result will obviously not their confidence but I think any good team will bounce back and get into the playoffs ok um, and a bit disappointing for Dagenham obviously uh, Chesterfield um, drawing to Woking so obviously they just finished outside the playoffs but if you look at it they finished strong for the season um, yeah well, what's your thoughts on that I mean, it's a shame that that 3 0 was for nothing, but obviously, you know, they ended the season strongly. But obviously, yeah, it would have been nice if the 3 0 would have meant something. But obviously, is what it is, nothing they can do. You know, they gave it their rules. It's just a shame that Chester got the job done as well. Yeah, okay, mate. Cheers. Brilliant. Thanks, Cheers, mate. So, obviously, the game's finished now. Uh, De Dagenham 3, Wrexham 0. Uh, great day. Enjoy myself. Brilliant, brilliant um, atmosphere from the Wrexham lot, especially when we was in the pub. Um, in, in Dagenham uh, obviously disappointed with their display they was obviously looking to get a um, a late a late promotion push but they're gonna have to settle for the playoffs now let's hope they make it through um, as they do not deserve to be in the National League they should be in League 2 but yeah um, hope you enjoy the uh, vlog remember to like comment share and subscribe and I've got some more content coming in the next couple of days as we go on the European tour Take care, guys. Remember, like, comment, share, subscribe. If you want to get me on social media, it's Nicky O'Shane 97. Peace out.